my group had a poster at, at AAN this year um, looking on the, at the use of a, a really commonly used seizure medication across the world called Clobazam um, in, in our patients in our center. Um, what's interesting is that the FDA um, in the United States didn't approve this medicine until about, um, I think about eight years ago, and it was only approved for the indication of Lenis Gusto syndrome. Um, in academic centers it's, and acro across the world, it's often used off-label, the, off the FDA label for all sorts of epilepsy. But when we look towards the literature, there's no evidence that that works. So we investigated the efficacy of clobazam in our patients where we do use it off-label across multiple different types of epilepsy. Really interestingly, in a, a very drug-resistant epilepsy um, cohort, we found that there was very high efficacy across all um, different seizure types with even in a drug-resistant focal epilepsy patient population up to a 20 percent seizure freedom rate with clobazam addition, which is really um, much better than a standard clinical trial. So we're hoping to um, look at longer term follow up in those patients and then um, publish that study. But it, it, it really, um, I think, is of interest because uh, outside of academic epilepsy centers, I, I don't think that clobazam is being used as broadly.